Hello and welcome to round one. I won the die roll, we will choose to play first. Uh, so this hand's a little slow. I think it's probably still a keep. Um, I guess it's kind of weird, but we should hope to draw into a, a two or a three drop. And so I've, uh, what do I want to do? I want to play that. Yes. Well, that's not a good draw. I'm going to have to leave this stupid thing up because Magic Online has changed my keys. What do I do? I want to do, uh, okay. Why is okay? Uh, two. Oh, really? Come on. It's worth noting, I think our opponent mulled to four. Yes, they did. So we can afford a slow hand against the mull to four. Um... Just to play Scrapper Champion here. It's tempting to play Spontaneous Artist and... Um, not give it any, um, not give it haste, but that just gives the game away, really. Sweatworks Brawler, sure. Okay, well, I'm just going to play an artist here. This gets a plus one, plus one attack, uh, counter when it attacks, okay. So if I can trade Brawler for Artist, which is not too. So in a pretty good position here. Um, opponent missed a land drop last turn. Presumably missed one again this turn. Huh. Well... Kind of getting screwed um, on the lack of black mana here. We can't really attack because they've got this mobile garrison. So I'm just going to play Welder Automaton and pass. We've got mana up to ping with Automaton, so we've got something to do with our turn. Smuggler's Copter? Ugh. Oh, opponent, opponent's uh, deck has some uh, power in it then. Okay, there's a swamp. Uh, what does a swamp do for us? Um, so we could like battle at the bridge, the sweatworks brawler, make them crew. I think I'm just gonna play Ali Strangler though. Because then they have to play a second creature uh, to be able to block the Alley Strangler. Release the Gremlins. So well, that's an annoying one. Are they going to get in with their creatures? No. Oh, Renegade Will Smith's great. Um... So, I think we battle at the bridge, the Sweatworks Brawler. In response, they'll crew something. We make it so it can't block. Oh, this has to become tapped, though, doesn't it? Hmm. That's a very good point. So, yeah, do we play Wheel Smith? I guess the other option is we can just attack with Scrapper Champion um, and trade it off for the Mobile Garrison. So if we play Spontaneous Artist, we're going to get in for five. So 
and then we can't. I guess we'll kill Brawler and Garrison. My opponent's left up two mana um, for the past two turns. I think I'm going to take the, the slower option here and just play the Wheelsmith. They kind of have to kill the Wheelsmith, I think, if they can. So next turn we can play Artist. We can only battle at the bridge for two unless we draw a land. And three really is the magic number. Lifecraft Cavalry. That's an annoying one. Ooh. What does Furious Reprisal do here? Okay, so if we kill the they they have three blockers, we can have five attackers. But if we kill a creature, they'll still have blockers. Um Hmm. So if we attack with Wheelsmith, they block it with mobile uh, well mobile garrison or the gremlin. It's not great. And we have seven mana, so we can only really cast one of our spells. I'm kinda of tempted by an alpha strike here, just I think we need to at some stage and then we can use the cards in our hand to mop up. This could be wrong. Um, I can't claim I've given a massive amount of thought. Uh, we'll say Lifecraft Cover we can't block. Sadly, we have no energy for Scrapper Champion. Sure, you crew your mobile garrison. This is where having some um, instant speed removal would have been so much nicer. The thing we know is we're definitely getting in for two. And our opponent's just going to trade, trade, trade. Sure. We're going to just put all our mana into battle at the bridge now. And then next turn we have Artist, we can attack for five. Another Lifecraft Cavalry? Ugh. Okay, well I like Ether Chaser. So I think we can just win next turn. Oh, prey upon, that's annoying. Maybe we can't. Opponent's deck looks really good. Um, uh, well, that means we probably do win, I think. So we, uh, the problem is we can't cast two of our spells. Huh. If we play Artist, we get him for <coughs> two <coughs> and create a servo, which unless they play another creature, we win next turn. I'm just going to charge his evolution here and tap down the forest. Sure, that's annoying. That was the card they were leaving up. They have a high spire infusion. Interesting. Uh, well, there's no point attacking. Hmm. 
Okay, land's a good draw. So we attack with everything. Uh, we're going to create a servo just as sort of a backup plan. I guess actually that wasn't so smart. Maybe we probably should have furious reprisaled the lifecraft cavalry end of turn there. Yeah, that was, that was pretty bad. Huh. Yeah, we, we're getting punished here. It's definitely a misplay. So, what do we want to draw here? Barricade breaker, maybe? I guess caught in the brights. <clears throat> so we could crack map in upkeep. I don't think it's unreasonable to keep map though, um, given we have our vengeful rebel. We draw Vengeful Rebel now, we can kill the Spontaneous Artist and win. Yeah. <clears throat> Opponent's drawn very nicely. Um, right, caught in the brights. What do you do? <sighs> the answer is, I think, not much, really. We... Do we, do we even bother playing it? So next turn, our opponents only have one card, so they can attack with like a 4-3 Gremlins. For a... They attack for like 14. I don't think we play Court in the Brights. I think we have to use it to win the game here. And the same with Furious Reprisal. We have to use these cards to help us win the game. Verdant Automaton. Well, that cruise smuggler's copter. Uh, I guess you can't... Um, loot with the copter. Oh, that Furious Reprisal misplay is really, really haunting us here. Okay. Do we play court in the brights? I, I still don't think we do. We can actually, I guess, no, we can't even furious surprise the automaton. They have mana. Ugh. Getting punished. So I think here I am going to crack Renegade map because we haven't got the time to um like draw a land here i don't think so we're gonna take seven i think we just take it okay well Now would be a time to cycle into something good. That's, that's not good. What is this? Precise strike? Sure. So this can only... Huh. So, like, if we attack with Sky Skiff, it's just going to get chumped by Smuggler's Copter. And the only reason we'd want to chump with uh, attack with Sky Skiff is to trigger Court in the Brights here. 
And then I think we're just going to be dead next turn. Yeah, we are just very dead next turn. Like we could court in the brights, but I don't think we want to show our opponent we've got it. So, well, that was pretty poor, really. Uh, we should have won that game. Very, very bad furious reprisaling from me there. Okay, so what do we want? Uh, opponent's red-green. Red-green with Smuggler's Copter. Very different deck. Um, we don't actually have any artifact removal. We're probably just going to have to do it as um, normal removal. And given we have, what, zero ways to kill it at instant speed, we're gonna, I'm going to bring uh, this underhanded designs in. Probably cut a uh, subtle strike. I probably didn't have many X1s uh, from memory. Do really want to bring in, like, another artifact. So... It might be Reservoir Walker. It gives us energy for Scrapper Champion. That's fine. Uh, we could bring Foundry Hornet out here. Again, they don't have many X1s, so that seems like a reasonable trade. Um, and then, I mean, we could bring in Precise Strikes, but, you know, don't really want to. Yeah, I'm just going to uh, make those changes and submit. Uh, definitely would like to play first. That is number three. Um, okay, this hand seems good. Uh, two drop into three drop. Mm, turn one and bridal breath, short. We've got a nice curve here. We're going to be able to go Chaser into Strangler into Artist. So they're going to play a 1-3, which completely negates the Chaser. And we're going to draw lands. Sure. Scrapper Champion would be a really nice draw here. Lands are not a really nice draw. Give the artist haste and swing in for five. Oh, did not mean to attack with the Eco Chaser. Ugh. Uh, I'm going to say yes to, to having a servo because I've just cocked up. Ugh. Ice Barrier Infusion. Sure. Okay, well, oddly attacking with the Ether Chaser didn't cost us there. Um, but it should have done. Okay, so they're revolting on turn four, so they're not playing Lifecraft Cavalry with the extra counters. Very good news for us. Whirler Maker, and what, missing a land drop? Okay, well, I, I can't not Chandra's Revolution tap down a mountain here. The least mana efficient play, but... Sure, Verdant Automaton. Um, so I think we definitely attack with Ether Chaser. Um, we probably want to create a servo. So we play Reservoir Work before combat. Let's say yes to that. Which is
sure. So French Cycling Implement. We get 2-3 out of it with their Verdant Automaton, which will stop our Aether Chaser attacking. But they're probably just going to have to... Oh, they've, they've conceded. Yeah, I think we're probably going to win anyway, because we're going to attack 5 with Welder Automaton on the board. Um, okay, well, our opponent got uh, Mana Screwed there, which worked out quite nicely for us, despite pretty bad misplay. Um, debating how good Precise Strike is. Maybe we want Precise Strike more than Rush. Possible. But I do quite like Rush. You know, Lifelink's good, Indestructible's really good against removal spells. So I think I'm just going to keep this. Yeah, I think this is an easy keep. But it's multi six. Oof. Not doing, not doing very well on their mulligans and stuff in this game. Uh, sure, reasonable draw. I think we just want to play Renegade Wheelsmith on turn three here. We cop turf nearly. Yeah, we probably, probably want to go Wheel Smith into Artist. And no turn 3 play. Interesting. So, Wheel Smith could just die to removal here, but it's the most aggressive play. Ooh, getting aggressive. Sure, we'll take three. I will, in fact, race you. Racing's probably not great for us, given they've got Lifecraft Cavalry, but... Sure, can't block. Uh, lands aren't good draws here. Attack us down to seven next. Uh, attack us down to ten next turn. Um, we can swing in again for eight. Oh dear, life gain. Okay, we need to be careful now. What does Grubs do? Huh. So we've got eight power on board, and we can add you know five power and two energy. Is this right? Um, three, six, eight, eleven, thirteen without pumping Grubs. Yeah, sweet. If my maths is right, that's 9, 13, sure. So it has no mana up. Oh, phew. well, we definitely stole a game there. Um, we should have won game one, and that was very poor, but I got there in the end. Well, so, see you back for round two.